two. Young wolf and ten horses walk into the clearing. <laughs> Johnny, hello, young wolf and ten horses. Young wolf, hello, tree planter. Who are these strangers? Who are you? 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 Johnny, meet my new friends. They came by wagon all the way from New England. They want to build a cabin here. They are good folks and good neighbors. Frontier Father. Johnny's right. Young Wolf. Tree planter always speaks the truth. Welcome. Welcome, friends. Ten horses. Be careful of the she bear, tree planter. Young wolf and ten horses walk off. <laughs> Frontier children, frightened. The she bear. <laughs> Johnny, yes, I've heard her growl a time or two, but. I get along with bears just fine. <coughs> Frontier Father, we must get back to the wagon. Thanks for everything, Johnny Appleseed. Frontier Family walks off through the, the trees. Johnny yawns <sighs> and stretches. <sighs> I'm so tired. <sighs> I'll sleep in this hollow log tonight and finish planting the apple orchid tomorrow. Johnny starts to crawl into the log. Narrator roars like a bear. Grrr! Johnny, startled. I'm sorry, Mrs. Bear. I'm sorry. I didn't know that this was your bed, too. I'll sleep under the tree over there. Look, over there. You have sweet dreams. You hear? Mm. Narrator growls warmly. Johnny sits under a tree and sleeps. Scene 2. Time. 
Many years later. Setting. Narrator and chorus are standing in an apple orchid. Narrator. Johnny Appleseed is now 70 years old. He's walked a long way and he's still going. Apple juice and apple butter. Apple sauce and apple cobbler. My oh my, sweet apple pie. Yum 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 Now you will hear the apple juice song being sung by second grade ESL students from Kuwait. Johnny, with a long white beard and pot on his head, walks into the orchid. Goodbye. He carries a bag of seeds over his shoulder and a bright red apple in his hand. Far did you walk, Johnny? Johnny must be thousands of miles. Chorus boys, how long did it take? Johnny, it took almost 50 years. Chorus boys, how many trees did you plant? Johnny, too many to count. Chorus girls, who eats all the apples? Johnny, the good folks who move out west looking for a better life. Do you still have itchy feet? <laughs> Johnny laughs. <laughs> I was born with itchy feet. Got to keep on going. That's what I always say.
This great new country needs lots of apples. They help us grow strong and healthy. Johnny bites into an apple and slowly begins to walk away. Chorus. Goodbye, Johnny Appleseed. Goodbye. 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 Bye -bye. Goodbye. 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 Bye -bye. Goodbye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Goodbye. Johnny, may you always be blessed with apples. Chorus Girls. Thank you, Johnny Appleseed. Chorus. Be careful of the bears. Johnny waves goodbye and walks goodbye. out of sight. Goodbye. 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 Bye bye. Narrator John Chapman died when he was 71 years old. never forget this pioneer and American hero. Girls, Johnny Apple, Chorus Girls, Apple Seed, Johnny, Johnny Apple Seed, John Chapman was his real name, the wild frontier he helped to tame. <laughs> chorus Boys, he planted apple seeds which grew into trees. This was his story. Everyone, clap now, please. Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. The end. <laughs>